Hotep, Hotep, my name is Logan Kitty Osai. I'm broadcasting to you on behalf of 13 Cosmic Law Astrology. And today I'm going in on Domino's Pizza. All right, already gave you the science on how Domino's Pizza or aliens or whatever, the ingredients is foreign to the human body, right? Gave you the science on that. Gave you the science on how you are your own God of your universe and that your body is is a is an individual universe in a collective multiverse every you are your body i am a universe in the collective universes so you have to govern your world you have to govern your world and you have to govern your world co uh, effectively you have to govern your world as a god effectively all right and just like you got aliens who come down and invade from the sky as above so below right the invasion of, of of all kind of entertainment and stuff like that God's people like all right well I'm just gonna go and get some pizza and then when they get the pizza you know what I'm saying when they bite the pizza it's like an alien invasion going down inside of their systems that you know the, the food is foreign to their systems aliens is something that's foreign to this civilization right and when you eat something that is foreign to what your system agrees with but those are aliens. Right, so now we're finna get it out to give you that. Now we're finna get into this. All right, we're gonna get into this. All right. We're gonna get into the pizza thing, bro. We're gonna get into the pizza. We're gonna get into the, you know, a lot of Christians say that the, that the dominoes, dominoes, the game dominoes, or the devil's playing ground. I disagree with that. It is an extraterrestrial game. It is uh, communication with ETs. But, you know, the universe knows is no respecter of person. So if the evil people know how to use it because Christians is brainwashed to believe that it's evil, then they're going to use it for evil. So we got to use the Domino's for good. But this is Domino's pizza, right? You see the Domino right there? It's the symbolism. It's my webcam. You see the Domino's right there? This is the symbolism. You know what I'm saying? The, uh, the, the, you got the feminine and the, you got the, the feminine and the masculine, right? Which is the male and female. You got the three, which is the father, son, and the Holy Spirit, man, woman, and children. Their agenda right there is to attack man, woman, and children. You know what I'm saying? Male and woman. They not, they not biased. They're try attacking the spirit collectively. So that's what the domino represents. You know what I'm saying? And then right here, if Dang, I wish I could show you. All right. Right here it says, we need fresh brains. I gave you the signs on how, if you watched the video and I talked about Messiah C level ones, that their job or objective is to, you know, um, their job or objective is to keep you out of consciousness. So whatever that they can do to keep you out of consciousness, you know what I'm saying, to keep you from being cognitively aware of what's going on, they've successfully succeeded in creating another job, right? And so right here, it says, this is on their box. This is what they're advertising. So they, they stuff. And don't take my word for it. It says, we need fresh brains. No, not because we're hungry zombies. And they are hungry zombies. If you have a great idea how to make dominoes even better, we want to to we want to have it. We want to what does that say? We want to hear it. From big bold ones to small city ones. Share your ideas at thinkoven.com see you have to know right beloved that they have to tell you the truth all right so they're telling you we want your we we want we need fresh brains they're telling you the truth but when they tell you the truth they tell you they have to tell you the truth because whatever's in the dark will always come to the light so they have to tell you the truth but then what they would do is they would try to camouflage the truth in the way to where you know what I mean? It's harmless. So they're telling you we need fresh brains because they have to tell you the truth. You know what I mean? 
And then they then they then they, they bring it like it's harmless by saying, Oh, if you have a fresh idea of how we can make dominoes better, then contact us, right? But really, you know, they want your brains. They want to keep you out of consciousness. Then right decipher this shit. This is the skull and bones. This, the fork is crossing right there, and this is the skull and foam bones thing going on. Says right here, handmade pan, pan pizza. Says, know your pan pizza genealogy. You know what I'm saying? And so, basically, right, they're creating. Then, on the other, if you look at the other box, I showed you how they had the, um, the alien spaceship zapping down the pizza and bringing the pizza back up they're putting all kind of extraterrestrial shit in these pizza boxes you know what i'm saying for reals um then let's 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 take a look at this pizza let's take a look at the pizza the actual pizza itself is a cipher i gave you the power to spin Look at my video talking about the power of the spin. This is what the macabre looks like. So this right here is actually a flying saucer. This pizza right here, right? So as above, so below. So above there, how they come in with the alien invasions and flying saucers, right? And they're extraterrestrial beings trying to invade you. You know what I'm saying? They're invading your space. Same here. You are invading your space by way of this flying saucer, which is a pizza right and then get this science it's made in the form of a pyramid they still dealing with the pyramid you know what i'm saying strategy dealing with you know what i'm saying the pyramid is aligned with the energy grid of the cosmos and aligned with your earth grid the energy grid of your earth of your world so now if you eat the pizza you're putting these aliens in your body this the pizza is filled with ingredients that that is alien that are foreign to your body and what you're supposed to be putting in your body. You know what I'm saying? Um, serious. Serious. So, right here, the eight for infinity. The two ciphers right there. This is this is the two ciphers or the infinity because they, they got to have these two. So they have to have the eight right here on a box because it's a portal in, out. It was it's a portal out of their dimension and into your dimension. That's dealing with the eight, the infinity, right? Bonus chicken wings, you know what I'm saying? That's their wings right there, they flying. Whatever. Right. Oven baked sandwiches, but only seven days in the week. So what does that mean? Why would you have to say that? Oven baked sandwiches, but only seven days in a week. Why would you have to say that? Why would you say that? Oven baked sandwiches, but only seven days in the week. They didn't even have to say that shit. You know what I mean? But they're telling you something. You got to read between the lines. Between the lines. They're telling you something right there. Oven baked sandwiches, but only seven days in the week. They're telling you something right there. You know what I'm saying? It says right here, check this out. Check this out. It says hair metal tricker. Order online and try one of Domino's six different tracker themes. What does that have anything to do with anything? Hair metal tricker they're trying to trick you are they telling you that they putting hair metal in your in your in your food what is that shit about 
Then they got the speakers right here. And this is supposed to be like the sound vibrating from these speakers, right? Everything is dealing with 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 sound and vibration. Then they got the 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 uh, the, the, uh, the lightning bolt wings right here. You know what I'm saying? The lightning bolt wings right here. Remember, I told you how you came down here. You lowered your vibrations to master frequency of the earth because. Thoughts slow down to form light. Light travels at 1,112 miles per second. Light slows down to form sound. And sound travels at 1,168 um, miles per second. Sound takes on shape. You know what I'm saying? And just like if you was to put salt or uh, sand on a board and you play a certain frequency, it's going to form a geographic. It's going to take on a geographical shape. Sound is. The sound of that frequency is going to make that sort form a shape. Well, the geographical frequency of your thoughts slowing down to form light, which is at traveling at 1,112 miles per second, and your light slowing down to form sound, which is traveling at 1,168 miles per second, it takes on a shape of a six-pointed com com configuration star and a five-pointed configuration star. The six-pointed con configuration star is dealing with the male. Uh, leg, arm, leg, arm, head, phallus, which is your dick. The six-pointed config config configuration star is the male. Then you got the five-pointed configuration star, which is the female. Um, leg, arm, leg, arm, head, uterus, in the, in the direction in which it's pointed outward, dealing with the woman. That is the store of David. You know what I'm saying? That's the store of David that they're talking about. You know what I'm saying? That you that, that you see right there. And that's how we took on our physical composition. That's how we got our human bodies. Because we lowered our vibrations from where we were up there in the cosmos to come down here. And we got our physical body that way. When our thoughts slowed down to form light. When our light slowed down to form sound. And it took on that geographical shape. The formation of the human body. Now as we begin to become more dense in formations. We took on all of the elements of the planet. That's why they said that... Um, Man, man was created in six days or on the sixth day man was created in the Bible, right? Because you have to understand that Adam and they say that Adam was the first man. Well, if you look at an Adam in science, right? It's metaphysical. If you look at an Adam in science, it's the, it's the 666 theory. It's the, you know what I'm saying? There's six protons, six electrons, and six neurons to make up an atom, all right? You know what I'm saying? And also the reason why they said man was created in the sixth day is because he took on the sixth element. He took on the sixth element of the earth, which was carbon. You know what I mean? So there's uh, uh, fire, water, earth, air, and ether, and then you got carbon. You know what I'm saying? And so, so, so man took on that that element right there. So all of this, it, it just, you know, in one of my other videos, I talked about, I said uh, Illuminati uh, exposed in Pizza Hut. I, I showed you the symbol of Pizza Hut. It looks like a flying saucer. You know what I'm saying? In this one, um, I did another one. I saw, I talked about Illuminati exposed in Domino's, and I showed you how they got their little. Uh, they flying saucers beaming down the pizza and beaming up the pizza. You want to look at that too. You know what I'm saying? So you got to see that they're telling you what time it is. But but you just have to be strong enough. Your willpower has to be strong enough to refuse it. And this is how you strengthen your willpower. Your willpower is strengthened when you deny yourself. Self-denial brings about discipline. And discipline is what strengthens your willpower. Your willpower is what makes you God. Your willpower is your God particle. If you can use your willpower, you, you use your imagination to create it. You use your emotions and feelings to vibrate on that frequency that will will it into existence. But it's your will that will attract it into this reality. You see what I'm saying? How strong is your will? You know what I mean? And so so basically, right, they attack the will with, with all of these different chemicals and stuff so that they can keep you out of consciousness. But if you're consciously aware of this, then knowing is half of the battle. Just knowing could give you power over that. Just knowing that it's evil would give you power over that. All right. Now you have to understand, right, that if you was just deny yourself, if you was hecka hungry, but you say, nah, I don't want to eat the pizza because I ain't finna like, you know, contaminate my body. I'm going to keep my temple pure or whatever. Then that right there brings you discipline. That discipline is what strengthens your willpower. All right. But say, for instance, right, you eat the pizza. 
then what happens is as long as you eat the pizza with the mind frame that this pizza is acrylic and that nothing in this pizza is going to harm me, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. As long as you think that, then the spirit would distill, you know what I'm saying, the toxicants of this pizza and it would not create harm for you. You see what I'm saying? See, you have to understand that over years, years of us coming down here, years of us coming down here, we we diabolically, you know what I'm saying, created a system to where we became like literally immune to the, like their chemicals and shit. So I was talking about, you know, Messiah seeds. I taught, I gave you the science on all of the Messiah seeds, right? And then I gave you the science on how they attack Messiah seeds level one. This is Messiah seeds level three. They're dealing with the, the first three Messiah seeds. Domino's Pizza are dealing with the first three Messiah seeds. This is dealing with Messiah seeds level twos. This is dealing with Messiah seeds level ones. And then collectively, they're dealing with Messiah seeds level threes. You know what I'm saying? So they think their ingredients are attacking the Messiah seeds, those first three levels. Because if you reach your, fifth, your fourth level, it's like they can't fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? You're unstoppable. So, you know, this is the Illuminati, you know what I'm saying? And they're alien, extraterrestrial, you know what I'm saying? Um, 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 advertisements. I'm, I'm debunking all of that. I'm, I'm, I'm giving you real science, real knowledge, you know what I'm saying? That you can really, really see with your own eyes. You know what I'm saying? That their plans to, to attack us and keep us out of consciousness. Because if you can keep a person, you know what I'm saying, distracted with the matrix of Facebook, with the matrix of uh tweeting, then 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 they, they don't, you know, they, they're not conscious. So that they're zombies. You have their brains. We need fresh brains. That's what they're saying. They said it right there. We need fresh brains. They're hungry for zombies. You know what I'm saying? As long as they got you tweeting, you know what I'm saying, then you're not worried about nature. You're not worried about the birds tweeting in the air, you're not concerned about that. As long as they got you worried about uh, Sprint and Blackberry cell phones, then then instead of Sprinting in real life, you would rather go to this to the Sprint store. You know what I'm saying? Instead of Sprinting in real life, you would rather go to the Sprint cell phone store and get a Sprint Blackberry. So instead of picking blackberries off of the tree dealing with nature, now you picking the, the hottest blackberry that came out technology. You see what I'm saying? Instead of listening to the birds tweet, you would rather be tweeting on that blackberry that you picked out of the Sprint store. You see what I'm saying? Instead of you facing a real book and reading some knowledge that will help you build your neurons, because I told you brainwaves are created by um, by building blocks of individual uh, 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 cells called neurons. And I told you how neurons are fired. You know what I'm saying? And, and the whole science of how you can tap into a higher brainwave than the five brainwaves that they laid out for you. They said that you only have five brainwaves when you conscious and four when you subconscious. I gave you the science, you know what I'm saying? On the, on the delta brainwaves, the alpha brainwaves, the theta brainwaves, the beta brainwaves, the gamma brainwaves, and the sensory motor, you know what I'm saying? Rhythm brainwaves. I gave you the science, you know what I'm saying? On this new brainwave that I've created called the phi, the phi brainwave, you know what I'm saying? How this brainwave is uniting us and linking us together telepathically, and how telepathically all those who are a part of the spirit can compute, can communicate telepathically, you know what I'm saying? Not just, you know what I'm saying, on this planet, but in, you know what I'm saying, other galax on, on other planets, on other galaxies, through the five brainwave. I told you how you can build your brainwaves up. So what they're trying to do is they're trying to create chemicals that will actually serve as agents that will go inside of your body and attack those brainwaves, attack those neurons so that they can't charge, so they can't fire. See, neurons, unlike, like, neurons are not like wires. Wires require energy. You know what I'm saying? Neurons in your brain, you know what I'm saying, don't require energy. They create energy by themselves. All right. Now when the energy travels from the from one from the from one end of the neuron to the other end of the neuron, it releases chemicals in the brains that communicate to the surrounding neurons. You know what I'm saying? And then it also releases what we call positive ions, you know what I'm saying, eons. And, and negative eons. When those positive and neg uh, uh, negative eons um, match, when they're paired together, you know what I'm saying, it creates something that we call action potential. And that's what we call, in science, that's what we say that a neuron has been fired when that takes place. All right. And so every time you think the thought, every time like you struggle with your memory and you're struggling like, damn, you know, um, what did that mean? If you just fight through it, if you be patient and fight through it, you know what I'm saying, and you remember, then basically what happened was, you know what I'm saying, your your negative eon and your positive eon connected, you know what I'm saying, and it formed the action potential. Then it, it that gives you more strength. It builds up, 
you know what I'm saying, more territory in, you know what I'm saying, your neocortex system and your limbic system and all of the, uh, the systems in your cognitive system. You know what I'm saying? It gives you more territory over your brain. And so I gave you the science about how to supercharge the brain. I gave you the science about how to activate your right side of your brain because they put you on your left side of the brain. That's when you know, that's how they, they program you. And they program you to believe that you only use 10% of your brain so that they can use the other 90% of your brain for you. You know what I'm saying? Dealing with the MK Ultra Mind Control programming. I told you how you had to start using your full brain. How you had to speak those things to be not as if they were. How you had to speak out of your mouth. I used the full maximum capacity in my brain i told you how to do that how to super supercharge your brain i gave you the science on that you know what i'm saying now i'm giving you the science on how they try to attack us through the foods however you know what i'm saying the spirit is so deep and through time our mental our mind frames overpowered the chemicals so that diabolically you know what i'm saying it no longer affects us However, you still have to protect your temple, period. If you want to be the most effective, keep it pure. But you can still eat the pizza. It's not like it's going to hurt you. You know what I'm saying? If you eat the pizza, you just eat the pizza. You know what I'm saying? Just eat it with an alkaline diet. Like, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. It can't defeat me. I will destroy it. You know what I'm saying? Period. And that's it. Well, um, that's me debunking dominoes. That's me debunking, um, you know, pizza or whatever. And exposing that and also letting you know as a messiah seed level one two or three be careful with these with this with what you put into your system and what you allow into your system whether it's even inhaling somebody's perfume or inhaling somebody's cologne can damage you you know what i'm saying it can damage your systems you know what i'm saying because the more neurons that you get to fire and connect effectively it builds action potential so if you think a thought for so long right it's creating building blocks in your brain that's how uh Brain waves are created through building blocks of individual neurons. You know what I'm saying? I told you how neurons fire. I told you about the action potential, right? Um, watch my video. It's called uh, Shape Shifting Star Seeds. You know what I'm saying? Watch that video. And you will learn more about this science right here and how I've talked about this this one brain wave called the Phi brain wave that will link us all together spiritually. All those who operate on love, it will link us all together spiritually. So, you know, um, that's my video for all of the Messiah Seeds out there. I love you. You know what I'm saying? Love and light. Hotel.